Welcome back. This is episode 14 of the Talos Principle, and I think you'll notice some differences. Uh, yeah. Let's go for it. Let's see. We got one over here. Wait, is there one over here too? Did we do everything on that side yet? Let's make sure. I think we did, but what's that? There are hidden dangers in this new world. I have inexplicably escaped death any number of times. I suggest vigilance. Who know what happens to those who step carelessly too often? Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Aha! There was one, one, more, one more up here. Oh, there it is right there. I can just walk right in and get it, right? Maybe not. This is over the fence. Okay. Give myself a little tour of the area. I've got a hexahedron. Another hex, two hexahedrons. Huh. Okay. Is that it? Maybe this is just to get you used to using them. What the? What is happening here? I am having difficulty moving my mouse. Well, let's see. Put one here. And then, oh, take the other one, jump up on this one, put it there. Oh, it doesn't matter. I just jump in. Then I'll place it. Yeah. There. Yeah, my mouse is sticking for some reason. You'll excuse me if I seem a little spaz tech today. See if I can pick that up. Uh, oh, psh, duh. There. There. <laughs> there you go. Okay, now... Now, what do I need more than just the jammer? I think I'm going to find out real quick. I don't... See the reason. Was that just to get the? Eh, okay. Hey, I want to see if I can walk out with this. Nah, I want to walk out with this. Nah, I'll take this. Yeah. Ow. I guess not. Fine. That's what uh, kind of concerns me about this game is that they're so they're so slowly uh, grooming you to use all the things that it's sort of like you're in a game like uh, Doom or or Quake something like that, and outside of a room is this box full of just every incredible weapon you can imagine. You know who you're gonna see in that next room. It's the meanest some bitch around. And I think they're I think they're learning me for the big one. Okay, this is something about a star. Okay. Now that's not the murder die kill one. That's just a what the hell is that? Oh, that's a star, yes. Mm hmm And I've got blue, red, blue. Hmm. Well, I don't see the... Where's the red? I mean, where's the... Okay, there's the two blues. Hmm. 
I'm thinking this may be Lucia Nathan, but I don't remember seeing a red one. Ah, uh, see, okay, red, 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 red. Was there red in here? No, no, I would have noticed. Good lord. Red. Where's the other red? Is it maybe on the next one? Wow. Well, if you can see something red to point that at, uh, you're a better person than I am. Star. I, that could easily be understood to be the star that you're trying to get, but it also could be a star on a building or something like that. All right, I'm going to have two. Go back and check and make sure I haven't missed some, something in here. Really? Was I over here further? Of course. Duh. The way I had it set up, it was going back and forth halfway. It gave it very little time. Oh, yeah, I see nothing, nothing here. Star. They've always been very obvious in there clues, but... Well, I guess I'm just going to have to do without that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful star. Maybe I can come back and get it later. Yeah, to heck with it. Yeah, sure, take it from me. Gah. We'll start over here. Hey. Yeah. Anyway, did I get I could have got this whole area? There and there. There. Okay. Hmm. 
What do you want? All right, load the survey. Hmm, I think I'll do that. What best describes the reason for your investment in the certification program's outcome? Why does being a person matter to you? I want to find out if I am one. I'll try to remember that. In fact, I'm going to help you. This is what I'm here for. Your problem, if I may, is that you don't know the first thing about anything, including what a person is. Your prospects are therefore poor. Do you even know where you are? Hmm... Some mad experiment? I think we best start from scratch. What do you know? I know 2 plus 2 equals 4. If you wouldn't believe a darn thing this place aside from the solitary fact. Wait, I suppose so. Even if you were dreaming, you would be certain of that. If I were, if I were you, I wouldn't believe a darn thing in this place aside from the solitary fact. That solitary fact. On reflection, it seems to me that we are no closer to resolving your problem. Perhaps we need more data. What makes you think you're a person? I'm alive. I feel. I'm conscious. You may very well say so, but how does that prove anything? To me, those are only words on a screen. What we need to uncover is what's going on underneath them, if anything. Thinking. The problem with people is, if you may be so bold, is that they're all convinced you're people from the inside. But there's no cast on our way to confirm as much from the outside. I'm going to process this and send you a notification when I'm able to assist you further. Terminating support session. Done. All right. Whoops. Okay, close. Just loading these into my journal, or whatever the heck it's called. You needn't worry about reading them. Everybody's got it. Okay. Well, shoot, I am. I am done here. Okay. This is window one from the first area. I mean, the second area. Window stew. I have promised you eternal life. But know that eternity may only be attained by those who serve a purpose greater than themselves. All else is decay. So it was written in the hidden words before the beginning of time. Okay. I'm, I'm cool with that. What is this? I keep having these dreams. Great empty cities. Silent roads stretching for miles. The earth from space, all dark. Not a single light to guide me home. But if someone really came from another world, what would the Earth look like to them? A wilderness? A wasteland? I don't think so. Even after thousands of years, they'd see a world shaped by our hand in every aspect of its being. They'd see the cities and the roads, the bridges, the harbors. And they would say, here lived a race of giants. These dreams, they scare me, but... They also remind me that we built all of this. Okay, I think that's a slight exaggeration because a thousand years would pretty much wipe any indication we ever lived from the planet, so. But I'll go with that. All right. Let's go clockwise again. 
this one is called Man on the Moon. Hmm. Okay. Court. Oh, ho, ho, wow. What? Uh. <laughs> Whoa, this is incredibly more complicated than it appears at first glance. Obviously. Oh my lord. Well, let's see what that does. this game. I really do. <laughs> okay, we got to bring one of them with us. <laughs> one of them? There was only one. Okay. Well, maybe, maybe not. Hang on. Let me check. There's got to be more to this than meets the android eye. Ah, I can just run over there. <laughs> no, I know that won't work. Uh, let's see. What? Okay, I have a key. Hmm. I don't see any obvious place to put a key, but that doesn't mean anything. Okay. Okay, key, 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 key. It may not be for anything here, but it may be for something like uh, one of these doors. I love the uh, the scenery, the setup here. Antiquity. Hmm. I don't see any need for a key here. Let's go. Let's go uh, see if I if we keep my key. And why do they have two? Well, the weight of that Oh, 
ho, 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 ho. You rat hole. Come on. Well, shoot. <sighs> I thought I was so smart. You're an idiot. You're a total idiot, Vern. Thank you. Ah, uh, that's why there's two fans, dude. Oh, where'd my box end up? Oh, there, duh, right there. Oh God. Her. Oh God, I'm only two away from having to do one of those puzzles again. <laughs> Okay, we're going to start the next one, and then we're going to say adios for today. Uh, I don't want these to be too long or too tedious, so we'll go into the L and see what it looks like. See what it's named. It's Higher Ground. And what do we have? We have... Wow, we have very higher ground. Can't jump quite up there, but... Okay. All right, here we go. We have a bell or something over there. This looks like it might turn out to be a really quite interesting one. Oh, and there's, there's another one. Wow. Okay, great. This one looks like it's going to be really interesting, guys. So uh, we'll take, a, we'll take a, a shot at that when we come back next episode. Thanks for being with me when, as I run through here going crazy. Uh, you take care of yourself. This is Dog Run Out. Love you guys.